The next movement is the grip, or lemlua. It can be played from E, high G, and high A. It is made from E by playing the note E, closing the chanter to low G, playing a D grace note, and then returning to E. And from high G, as in the tutor book, and from high A. It's most important in all of these movements to make sure that the fingers move together in concert to close low G and then the degrace notes made and the fingers all move together to make the new note. Otherwise, you will get small catches or crossing sounds. The movement after this is a very important movement called the Torlua movement. It is played from low A like this. And it's quite simply low A followed by low G, D grace note, and then a clean E grace note back to low A. Once more. This can also be played from the note B. Also, as in our grip movements, it is very important to stress that the fingers move down exactly together to close low G and leave exactly together so there are no sounds or crossing noises which uh, detract from the movement. Once more from B. Mm -hmm. 